back to Selkie Gills. It is a uh, bath and bath time. Water temp is a blistering, a freezing cold 79 and a half degrees. So. Yeah, that's the, the problem. Oh, I mean, weed fish. Weed fish. No, don't let him fool you. No, sir. Yeah, look at all that weed. The video footage will say otherwise. <laughs> A pinfish. I'm getting good at catching those. Come out to Baffin before we go offshore next time. Yeah. Snapper candy right there. Stop. What the? Did you just see that? Uh, Did you? That's a right dollar, right? That trout bumped it and then jumped on top of my lure. not be such a Hey, stop. Bro, you're making me look like an amateur. <laughs> Ow, you bit me. Okay. Well, he didn't want to be seen, but he was a keeper. Oh, man. Off or a weed fish, one of the two. Now, the fish. Come on. They're right in front of Kaylee. Yeah. Uh, so moving back and forth a little bit. I can move out just a little bit. Another one, guys. Yeah. Guys, so we're fishing a uh, 
I'm throwing a custom down south this morning. Kaylee would put it somewhere. Um, 16th ounce jig head and uh, short shank on that. I think, can't remember the ought. Kaylee can go through it. Um, 20 pound leader, 15 pound braid. And uh, getting out there fishing a little deeper today and just letting it hit to the, uh, to the bottom. Do two twitches, letting it fall. And just uh, based upon the depth out to my right, it's a little deeper, letting it fall a little longer. A um, little bit bigger twitches when I'm throwing out here to the left, it's coming up a little bit. And uh, working good this morning. Just uh, trying to tune them in, wind's completely different. So uh, seven to two on this reel, Corrado, or this is a Tranks Shimano, and then a uh, medium fast Waterloo. Works really good for throwing these these lighter lures in the in the summertime, the fall. Um, you even throw soft downs with them; they work pretty well. He just slurped it. Little guy. I went to all white, but it's not. You're on the obnoxious color. Yeah. Oh yeah. Nice small. Hit it like a ton of bricks though. As soon as it hit the water. All right, we're finally on the board, folks. Easy, cheesy. Uh, I switched to that tequila lime, yeah. Like you that. switched to tequila lime? Yeah. Hey, hey. Why are you doing that? You dumb. That's fish. honestly not a color I would have picked. Really? No. Yeah, as I say, that sun's starting to come out. That's why I put I, it, it on. I, I agree, it looks good in the sun, but I probably still wouldn't have grabbed that. What'd you say? I, it, it's working for you. That's why I was surprised. It's not a oh. color I would have grabbed. Oh. Okay. Not with this water color. Oh, the guy. Oh, very greeny. Yeah, that's the issue I've been having too. All right. That did not sound what good. What the f keeps happening? You're throwing too hard. I heard your whip. Your rod should not make a whipping sound.
thought about it. He ate it. Man. Not supposed to do that, buddy. Way being difficult. Bro, man, you took that one deep. All right, let's make a move and see if we can find something else for tomorrow. That way we ain't stuck to one spot. Thank you guys for watching this video. This is our first day back in Baffin after quite a few cold fronts. Stay tuned for the next couple of videos where we found some monster trout and figured out what they wanted. Like, subscribe, and comment down below. Are you ready for Texas to get cold? Salty Gills, come get some.